Hello everyone, JRDL96 here with a brand new reaction. As you can tell by the title, it's another Markiplier video and it's another random vlog-ish type video that Mark decided to do. Now this kind of caught my eye because of the subject matter. I guess apparently he's trying to take 100,000 steps in a day. Which is kind of sounds like what you would do with something with the Apple Watch. Like with the exercise stuff on your Apple Watch. Like right now, as of right th at this moment, me, I got 127 steps. So this kind of sounds something like I would do, but not to that extreme. I don't go, I don't try to f count how many steps I take. I try to make sure I stand for at least a minute and it counts. <sighs> Usually, the way I do it is by running in place, that always works. But anyways, um, I might as well see how does Mark <laughs> handle this. <clears throat> so without further ado, let's react to this video, shall we? I am a broken man. I don't know why, but I decided one day hey, we're matching shirts. that I was going to try to get 100,000 steps in a single day. I don't know if it's because I'm in lockdown because of coronavirus. I don't know if it's because I'm going crazy, but I decided Perhaps to I'm the crazy one. And let me tell you, I was woefully unprepared. Woefully? The amount of work that would be required to accomplish it and the insanity of what I was trying to do in the first place. The average person in a given day, if they're even moderately active, will walk 10,000 steps. That's pretty impressive. That's a lot of steps. I was doing 10 times that number. I started my day off just seeing if I could. I was walking around my pool. I was experimenting. I was seeing which style of walking might do this because theoretically, in <laughs> my mind, I thought that it would be possible. And technically, yes, it is possible. However, what However, I quickly realized, 100,000 steps is a lot. Is a lot of steps. So apparently I only was walking for five minutes. It felt like forever. There are only 86,400 seconds in a day. day. Of those 86,400, you're only awake for about two-thirds of them. That gives you 57,024 seconds. seconds of rise and shine waking energy to be able to do the walking. That's almost two steps a second for the entire time that you're awake, you have to be walking at a vigorous pace of about 130 steps per second or jogging at 140, or in my case, fast. So after I finished my initial huh. research, I See, you, realized that I needed the epif to adapt the epiphany my lifestyle has. to the mobile lifestyle. I literally can't stop stepping. Like, it doesn't matter like if I'm doing fast or slow. I think that's the only way that I'm gonna be able to get to 100,000 steps. It seems like a bigger so you try and track it with your watch? Always adding in steps wherever I could. No matter what I was doing, I was always moving. And this is where the psychological changes started to take place. I realized that my life was very static. I'm sitting down <laughs> right now. Number one, I'm sitting down right now because my legs don't work. But number two, I'm sitting down just because that's what normal people do at a computer. I've got a standing desk and sometimes <laughs> I stand That's what Jack does, has too. He has the, 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 the desk the that part, lowers and rises. I a pretty sedentary life. So I needed to change that. That's how many dudes I need every excuse to walk today that I can get. <laughs> so I started doing everything mobile. I made my coffee while walking. Yeah, that's around. that, that that's definitely me. Look at the mess and on the floor. In doing so, I got a lot more clumsy than I was before. I ended up spilling things. I ended up spilling the pancake mix. Yep. Way more messes than I ever thought I needed to. I almost hit Chica. I just dropped trash on Chica. Oh, no. You ass. But I was mobile, and I was getting my steps in. And I hit 10,000 steps pretty early on in the day, which made me think, hey, maybe I got a shot at this. The only problem is the sheer scope of 100,000 steps is it's a lot. I actually noticed that I was a lot more productive. Because I was moving, I had to use every excuse possible to do something to move. So I ended up doing dishes. I ended up vacuuming. That's a very mobile chore. I ended up doing the laundry, which isn't too mobile, but it, it, <laughs> it is if you do it inefficiently. If you put away clothes one at a time, yeah, it becomes a lot more, uh, a lot more walking involved. I did everything. Any spare moment of my time was dedicated to walking because that's what I had to do. Another challenge was just trying to 
walk while I was eating. Yeah. <laughs> hot sauce all over that shirt. No, no, fine. Hot sauce? Yeah. Amy's like, what the fuck are you trying to accomplish here in life? <laughs> what I didn't factor in was just the sheer amount of calories I was going to burn doing this. Energy, yeah. Energy, energy, energy. Walking takes energy. And you don't. I usually burn, burn around 300, over 300 like calories. When you're doing it all day long, you are burning an astronomical amount of calories. The average person, about 160 pounds, will burn 40 calories per thousand steps. That's 0 0.04 calories per step. Now, I'm 180 something pounds, so 180 <laughs> would probably burn around, around 140 per thousand steps so divide by a thousand you get 0 0.045 calories per step i'm trying to do 100,000 i was going to burn 4,500 calories oh, jesus day. christ did this. and that's assuming i'm not walking fast and i was walking fast i had to do it fast i had to do it fast because i didn't have time use your treadmill step 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 do a treadmill i think that was an easier way to do it step 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 oh my god step 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 christ almighty try saying the word step 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 times that's about the same i ended up taking the dogs out walk down to the park perfect excuse take the dogs out for a walk get their steps in get my steps in dogs have it easy they have four legs. Like, they're taking twice as many steps as yeah. they because they got twice as many legs. It's not fair. Once I got about to 31,000 oh steps, my I, God. I could do this. And then I had videos to make. I had to figure out a way to step while I was standing at my desk. But I came up with a solution. Turns out this watch doesn't really care if it's on your wrist or on your ankle. And if I'm standing, I can always march in place and get my steps in. That way I can still play Doom and work out. Let's do this. Work around! Except for the fact that it's like uh, patting your head and rubbing your tummy if you're trying to actually play, say, Doom Eternal. <laughs> Do the hand-eye coordination thing and try to step at the same time. It's kind of hard. But I got my recording done. I got what I needed to do done. Then the rain started. Unfortunately, it's raining, which means that I can't lap around the pool and I am way off target. It's currently 418 and I'm at 42. Wow, he only steps. made 10,000 steps in the next three hours. Four o'clock. I gotta kick this into overdrive, but I gotta figure out how. I was looking forward to walking around the pool. I'd walk inside. Trap. Inside. So I <laughs> kept trying to stay helpful. I'm trying to help Amy around the kitchen. Hey, do you need me to get you? No, that's me. That's totally me when I'm trying to. Uh, no. Yeah, I got you. I got you. When I am on oh, the 58 minutes, 59 minutes Can't past the hour. Playing Animal Crossing by walking in front of the TV. <laughs> I got a fossil. That's me at the 59 yeah. minute past before the yeah, next hour hits. 51,980. He got another 10,000 steps in an hour. Halfway. There. Living on a prayer. But there's a problem. I've almost run my watch out of batteries. I have never in my life run this thing out of batteries in a given day. Wow. This almost always lasts the whole day. Then came the trouble of trying to keep track of my steps without my watch. Had to download a pedometer. Then more walking, more walking, more walking, more walking, more walking, 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 walking. Oh my walking, god. Walking, 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 walking. I was so goddamn hungry. I'm starting to get hungry again. I was so unbelievably hungry. Oh, I feel the hunger. I couldn't find The hunger it. shakes, the headaches. Day, I had already eaten about 3,000 calories. calories. I can eat 3,000 calories in a day, but at this point, food was just becoming a chore. So I took a dinner break. I started getting so hungry. I'm getting real tired. My feet are hurting real bad. And I had a lot more walking left to do. It's 6.42. I've only got so many hours left. In Four hours at least. 42,000 steps. Jeez. So I walked. About 60,000 steps in, my foot started hurting. I'm getting this foot pain. Like a deep pain in my biggest of toes. And I didn't know if my tiny tootsies would be able to tolerate another 40,000 steps. But step I did. 
I had to adopt a quicker step style that was more like a jog, and I I, I just can't I, can't I can't describe the boredom. <laughs> like at this point, I've been look at walking look so at she because she's I'm like and Amy's boring. like what yeah, in the Amy hell like, are you doing? Really fun to watch, but you know, only for a little bit. The rest of the time, it was just like ow my foot, ow my legs, ow my, <laughs> my leg. God, I'm hungry. That was it. I was bored. I was hungry, and I was in your ADHD pain. is kicking in. I've never had my in. life boiled down to such simple needs. My heart rate was a consistent 100 to 110 for pretty much the whole damn day. Like, that's not a big Ow. workout, but all day, all day, my poor heart. And then I made the horrible mistake. When I got to 70,000 steps, I decided I needed to take a break. Not a good idea. No. And what's funny is the body has methods of convincing you that you're stupider than you try to become. And when you do something stupid enough, your body decides that it's time for the stupid to go away. And it shuts you down mid-stupid. As soon as I lay down, my legs literally stopped working. My legs don't work anymore. My muscles just wouldn't muscle. I physically can't. I was like, I'm gonna take 30 and I'll see how I feel. I don't feel, <laughs> I don't feel anything below my knees. Oh, my foot no. was in such pain. I couldn't jump. Couldn't do it. Couldn't do it to save my life. <laughs> so painful. Amy had made cookies and I was just like, I was just gonna cookie. I couldn't walk up the two steps to get to the kitchen to get a cookie. I couldn't walk two steps. <laughs> Game over, guys. Good, good, good try. Fair play. No handshakes. No, no touch. Six feet. Man, just pure relief. <laughs> you know, I, I thought I would have been laying there in pain, but all I could think about when I was laying on the couch eating a cookie was just, my God, thank goodness. <laughs> I didn't want to hurt myself trying to do this. I'm not that big. Try to dumb. And when injure I got yourself. To the point where I decided, like, okay. I need to stop for the sake of my own health. I was so happy. <laughs> I'd never been happier in my life. I was laying on the couch watching Amy play Animal Crossing. I was like, this is fantastic. I was eating cookies. Like, this is great. I love it. Life's good. You know, no problems at all. I love it. But yeah, I did that. I mean, I didn't accomplish my goal, but I got damn close and I got a lot farther than I thought I would. That was the most productive day I've ever had. 70,000 so steps. I got so much laundry done. So many Three quarters of the way so there. Little things that I thought like I would never have time for and I did it. And I went and recorded videos too. And I walked 70,000 steps. And probably more because my, my watch wasn't exactly super accurate at getting steps. I was like calculating out. I was like counting in my head 100 and my watch would record like 94. It's not enough to get me to 100,000 by any stretch of the imagination, but I, I think I actually got closer to 75,000 that day. But even so, holy crap, that was rough. It was a lot of work. And the moral of the story is that, you know, sometimes you just gotta try. Sometimes you just gotta try something stupid, you know, that no one else will do just because, you know, why not? It's not gonna kill me. It might break my foot. <laughs> well, I love challenges like that. I love challenges that I don't know if I can accomplish. Where literally I'm like, I have to dedicate myself to this 100%. Otherwise, it's just one of those thoughts in your head that's gonna go in and then pop out and never come to life. And that's so many ideas in my mind. I have tons of ideas of stuff that I want to do all the time, and I always talk myself out of it because I think it's crazy before I actually do it. <laughs> this is just one of those things that I didn't let sit in my mind, and I didn't let it become nothing. I actually did it. I, well, I mean, I didn't. I couldn't. You, you had to stop because your body said, fuck and, it. And uh, my only regret was that I didn't stop at 69,420 steps. <laughs> of course. Or did I? Oh, no. Four? Come on. Come on. Please. Not like this. One, two, three, four. It will not move. This is so weird. This thing will not move. It's... It's... Oh, no. No. No, no. Just over five. Ah. <laughs>
Oh my god. That is just fucking crazy. Oh man, why did you do, why did you decide, hey, why don't we try to do 100,000 steps? But yeah, that is totally me. Yeah, I, I kind of can relate when I try to do stuff. Like, I don't know what I, why I wanted to do this, but there was like a little challenge that, that I had on my watch. It was a heart month challenge. And you had to close your exercise ring seven days in a row from starting from February 8th to February 14th. That was what the challenge was. But I'm like, but at the same time, I was like, okay, that will be interesting to do. But also, that will also make me close the, um, my exercise ring, you know, to close my exercise ring in a week. So I was like determined and I was really determined to do it. Like it's stupid as fuck that I decided to even think about doing this, but I was like, you know what? Why not? When we try something. When we try to close my ex my ex have a perfect week of exercise and a perfect week of standing. Let me try to have like at least that award. So I was determined. <laughs> I was really determined to get there. Like so so much to the point I think one time I had to go downstairs because I didn't want to go running around in the kitchen. I decided just to go downstairs in the basement. And the original idea I had I wanted to do was just to run in place. Just run in place. Like so, like this. How was that? Okay, whatever. But run in place, try to get my exercise to go up, which it what it does count. It does technically like count it. So I'm like, I'm trying to do some stuff like this, and I was like, and I had like t ten minutes in that day, and it's like ten fifty in the at night so I didn't want to break that streak so I had to make sure I didn't want to miss it so I spent the next few 30 minutes or so just exercising just to get to that point point. and right now I have I hit hour two I had two hours today I don't know if you could see well, you can't really see because it's upside down, but yeah, so far. But yeah, that, that's how, I, how it was with me. And I wanted to make sure I get that perfect week. So I decided just to do that. That's how I decided to do it. Because of that one challenge with the Valentine's Day thing. So I was like, I gotta do this at least. Hell, I even did it. <laughs> I even did some of it when I was dressed up as Darkiplier when I did the cosplay at that time. I actually had to, I didn't do like a lot. Like I only had to do like maybe uh, two minute, like maybe three minutes total. That's all I had left. Just three minutes of, to in the day to do. But I'm pretty sure at this point I probably burned a lot more calories than I could imagine. And there is an award, there's like a, an award when you earn this award every time you quadruple your daily move goal, which is 1,200, 1,200 calories. Right now I'm at 14 calories, so I gotta get 1,200. I don't know if I'll be able to do that. I'm surprised I haven't, there wasn't a time I did, especially when I was on the cruise and stuff like that, because I'm pretty sure I burned so much calories at that time. <laughs> I burned so much calories at that time. Let me see if I could find it. Hmm. 
I, it somehow offloaded my the uh, activity app, which made sense. Um, let me see. Oh! I think the closest that I had, I was, I was so close, which was on Friday, May 11th. I think that was one of the last few days on the cruise, and I was just walking around, just running around. I hit 149 exercise minutes, st stood for 15 hours. Yeah, and after that, didn't even come close. <laughs> what was the closest I ever been? Let me try that one time I went to the Yankee game. Nine hundred calories. <laughs> oh fuck's sake! Sixty-four minutes. Oh. And then I, when my when I had my cousin sweet sixteen, I was a thousand calories. Eighteen hours. Oh my god! I don't know. I don't know how the hell I have not been able to reach those calorie goals but I think that's the next goal I have just to hit 12 like at least 400 percent quadruple my move goal which is 300 calories that's my goal at least I've earned my move goal 553 times and that starts ever since 2015. So, July 2015, 500 times. And I feel accomplished when I do it. I'm like, yay, I did it. <laughs> but I don't, I can't imagine, can't imagine like how excruciating, like, I don't think, especially during that part when he was recording videos and he had to do the freaking exercise stuff, when he had to do the little steps, when he had to exercise and record videos at the same time, I don't think I would be able to do that. To keep track of both of those and try to make sure you focus on the game that you're playing, like, you know, I don't, I can't imagine how hard that was, especially when, if, especially when you have ADHD like I do and especially with him. I don't know how he was able to focus on both of those at once. I'm pretty sure he was medicated. To, he got a double dose of that medication just for that moment. <laughs> but he only got so close because his body shut down after he decided to, take, to do the stupid thing, which is lay down on the floor for a moment. Would I try, like, but the thing is, like, with me, like, I'm pretty sure some people would ask, like, would you try to do that? I think, like, the only ways I think that could be, ha that could happen with me is if I decide to, like, you know, run on the treadmill or around a high school, uh, a track, <laughs> track and field. If I decided to go down to the high school and just run around for god knows how long depending on how long i remember running 10 miles in maybe an hour and 10 15 minutes 10 miles four laps around that track is 1600 meters which is a mile so i had to run a lot of laps four times how many laps? Oh, jeez, I can't. So, 4, 8, 12, 16, 
20, 40 laps, I think. <laughs> I don't know. But 10 miles in that short span of time, and especially when I had also the middle school kids show up to do their practice for track, and I still, I couldn't, I still didn't stop. I st I kept going. Like, I didn't give a damn. I wanted to, to do this. But the thing was, like, leading up to that moment, like, I was slowly running more and more. Like, running up to, like, a mile, three miles, four miles, five, six. Like, I was slowly making my way up to a certain point without stopping. And I don't know how I was able to do 10 miles in one shot. My knees were shot. Everything was shot. My whole body was like, fuck you. <laughs> but yeah, after I was done, my body was like, that's enough for today. <laughs> as soon as I finished the last lap, my body was like, already knew. Yeah, you're done. <laughs> so go home. Like the stupid ass you are, go home and just think about what you did. <laughs> you jackass. But uh, anyways, enough rambling. I rambled on long enough about myself. But overall, that was kind of a kind of funny to see him try to get over ten thousand, a hundred thousand steps in a short span of time, period of time. Would I try to do that? Maybe. <laughs> one time. Maybe the one time I decide to do it. God knows when that will ever be. But I want to try it at least, you know. It's worth a challenge. And also try to get 1,200 calories burned in a day. That would be nice, you know. So I have to really dedicate a day to myself where I decide to, like, you know, run in place and do stupid shit just to make sure I get to that goal, you know? So anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed today's reaction. If you did, if you did, hit the like button, subscribe, share this video with your friends. Be sure to ring that bell to be part of the notification squad. Be sure to check out my Instagram because I make cool ads and market wire, Jack the guy, even myself. I hey, also do reenactments of cosplays on there, so go check it out. Be sure to check out my Tumblr and my Discord in the description as well. So until next time, Jerry the only six signing out, and I will see you guys in the next video. Peace.